Hey guys, what's up? It's Audra and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today is day seven of the 12 days of Christmas countdown and I have a little gift giving idea for you today. So as you can see, oh, what's next to me? Today is going to be a stocking stuffer idea video. So I'll show you guys, this is my stocking. I've had it forever. I'm just going to be going through a list of ideas that I would give to people in their stockings and that's how this is gonna go so let's do it okay at number one on the list and this one is possibly my favorite one from the whole entire video I have cabin socks so I feel like a lot of people don't think about these as stocking stuffers but I feel like they're the perfect stocking stuffer because it's still like a good gift so like these are I guess these are like stocking stuffer or like small gift ideas um, but I always think that cabin socks are such a good gift because who doesn't use cabin socks in the winter? Like literally no one. So I always feel like it's such a good idea to get cabin socks and they always, always have them on sale. So like, you can get cabin socks, like buy one, get one free, like all the time. And so I feel like it's just such a good idea. Just buy some, have them around, and then you can throw them in stockings or like give them as like a little, like, you know, secret Santa white elephant, whatever you guys do type of gift. So number one is cabin socks. Number two, we have chapsticks. So I feel like there's always those like holiday, like Christmas, like chapsticks that come out, you know, around this time of year. And I think they're super cute. And obviously if you're from somewhere cold like us, you go through an insane amount of chapstick in the winter. Like I literally will go through like a whole entire like chapstick, which is very rare. I feel like people don't really use all of their chapstick like ever it just like gets old and then you throw it out but who wouldn't love a chapstick in their stocking when it's this cold out and your lips feel like they're going to shrivel off of your face and die like come on tell me it's not a great idea number three I have candy basically any kind my favorite one to give in stockings or like as a small gift is the Ghirardelli's Ghirardelli's however you say it peppermint chocolates the little square like peppermint barks that they have uh, because it's Christmas themed and it's also very very good it's probably my favorite Christmas like candy or like chocolate ever uh, but I think any any type of candy works like if somebody has a favorite candy throw it in their stocking it's not hard to find it it's pretty cheap like very easy you can pick it up anywhere you don't have to go anywhere specific you could get it at literally a gas station throw it in the stocking Throw it in that white elephant, doesn't matter. People are gonna love it no matter what. Number four is sample sized products. So I feel like stockings and smaller gifts are a great way to give people like products that they can try out. And this goes for anything. Like for me personally, I think of like makeup, but also like skincare and like anything like that, I think is a really good idea for like these little small gifts because they're inexpensive, they're not that much, so if the person ends up not really liking it as much as whatever else they use, you know, they don't have to buy it again and you didn't waste your money on it. And sometimes sample size products come for free when you buy something else. So I always pay attention to those deals. One year for Christmas, I it was around the time and I was buying like a primer for my skin. And around the same time, it was like a Christmas deal where if you bought a primer, you got a sample size product for free with your purchase. And so I got Haley like this sample size product for Christmas for free that she ended up really liking. But like that kind of stuff, like it's literally like you can just get it when you buy something else. Like you don't have to seek out these little products. They're normally just show up with other stuff, but they do also have like small products everywhere like you can get them everywhere so that's one thing that I always think that people forget about is like if you want somebody to try something new that's a good way to do it and it's a good put these stockings to good use okay number five this one is scrunchies or hair clips um I I am obsessed with all of the above um right now my current obsession is the hair clips like the claw clips um but there's all kinds of cute little like you know decorative hair clips like ones with like pearls on it or like the little butterfly ones like there's all kinds of stuff they're very cheap like claw clips big ones are like five dollars there's packs for five dollars of like smaller ones or like the little decorative clips or packs of scrunchies for like literally like five bucks on like amazon that are like super nice 
and very easy. And if you buy like a big pack of them, you can open it up and split it between people too, you know? So it gives you lots of options. They're cute. People will love them. It's like the style and the trend right now. So you'll be up with the up with the times, you know? Um, so that is that is number five. Number six is jewelry of any kind. If you have anybody who wears jewelry, this is a really easy time to throw in some earrings or a necklace or a bracelet. Any any small like type of like dainty jewelry. It doesn't have to be expensive. You could get them Christmas earrings for all that matters. You know what I mean? They have those cute little like snowman earrings or like a Christmas necklace or like this necklace is from like H&M and it was literally like seven dollars or something and you could throw that into a stocking so jewelry i think is always a good idea there's so many options if you want to go expensive if you want to go cheap there's anywhere in between there you can find basically anything that you're looking for and i think that's the best thing about a stocking stuffer is you don't you don't have to search for it like it, you literally can just stumble upon it and it makes it really easy number seven weirdly enough this just happens in my family i don't know if this is like anybody else beef jerky or like beef sticks like any type of those like little snack snacky foods my brother used to ask for like food all the time for christmas like one year he literally asked for like a bottle of ranch for christmas and i was like anyways um that is always a good idea because those are again very cheap you can throw them into a stocking um you can get those beef sticks like our like schools around my area like sell them and like i bought a bunch of them already this year but like they're like literally a dollar and you can just Toss those in, toss those into the stocking. And they're good, and usually people eat them like as soon as they get them out of their stocking. Like they wake up, dig in. So it's just a little, little something that's like kind of funny because it's like who puts a beef stick in a stocking? But it's also a cute little gift. Number eight, guess you would have, you never would have guessed this one. A first to 11 Christmas CD. What? No, but I'm serious, like, Christmas, any like little Christmas CDs or like, I don't know, I, I just think those are cute, especially for like, if you have to get stuff for stockings or like little secret Santas for like older people, like they love, they love to listen to CDs, like a lot, like my grandparents, they have like CD players in their house and they like listen to CDs like all the time still. So anytime I see one, like one year I literally got my grandma a Christmas CD for Christmas before we started doing Christmas. Now my grandparents all get the first 11 Christmas CD. But I'm serious though, like those are so small, they fit in stockings, they're easy to wrap up, they're inexpensive, you can give them as like cheaper gifts if that's what you're looking for. Um, or you can gather up a bunch and, and give them as a big gift. There's, there's all kinds of options for those. A lot of people release like special holiday CDs and so you can find them pretty much anywhere. And you can find all of ours on our website, first211.com slash shop. Number nine is hand sanitizers, especially this year. Uh, Bath and Body Works is my go-to for that. They always have those little hand sanitizers. They're always Christmas scented, very cute, and they're honestly very practical. They're very nice to just throw into a bag when you're traveling, when you're, you know, just your day-to-day, -day, throw it into your car so you just have it all the time. I love to give those and I love to receive them. I love getting those little hand sanitizers. And that's the same thing for like those little mini like lotions and stuff too that come from like Bath and Body Works. But I think those are really good ideas because people will actually use them. They're very cheap and they're very easy to find because you don't have to get them at Bath and Body Works. They have those everywhere. You can find them everywhere. You just have to like pass by them and like they have them at like Walmart. Like you can you can find them anywhere. They're very easy and people will need them. Last but not least, number 10, I have hot chocolate. So I love getting the little like gourmet, like hot chocolate packets for people for Christmas. And I'll throw them in a stocking or even like grab like a mug and put it in a mug for like a secret Santa or a white elephant gift because I just think that they're super cute. And my favorite one is a Starbucks like peppermint hot chocolate. But there's like so, so many that you can find. I know like this is even a little excessive, but like when we were in Disney one time, my brother got these little hot chocolates from there that were like salted caramel and like white chocolate and blah, 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 all these flavors. But you can find those anywhere. Like they have these really good, oh, what's the name of it? It's called Land Lakes Hot, hot Chocolate. Land Lakes Hot Chocolate. It's very, very good. And they have like so many different flavors and they're so cheap. Like I will literally just buy those up so quick. I, and they have just 
all the flavors are like crazy and they have a bunch of Christmas ones and then just like different regular flavored hot chocolate. But I think hot chocolate is super cute around the holidays and like, I don't know. I just think it's a cool gift and it's like easy. People can make it at home. It's not difficult. You don't have to like make homemade hot chocolate. You can just throw in a packet of hot chocolate to whatever you want and then just have it. And it's nice to have an open on Christmas because I always think like some people drink coffee in the mornings, but like maybe somebody would like to have like a hot chocolate on Christmas morning. They get it out of their stocking and then they can just have it that day. So I think that's a really cute idea too. All right guys, that is the end of my stocking stuffer ideas slash small Christmas gift idea giving list. Uh, and the end of day seven of the 12 day countdown to Christmas. We, this is seriously flying by so fast. I hope you all have been enjoying the previous six videos that I've put out for the past six days and I hope you are getting excited for the holidays because I know I am I'm so ready for Christmas and if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss an upload right now every day from now until Christmas December 25th at 2 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time bye see you tomorrow